Hello YouTube friends. So today we're going to look over my adult coloring book collection and similar books. Most of these I purchased at the Dollar Tree and if you like Dollar Tree hauls and if you like adult coloring books, which is an awesome way to de-stress and relax. However, some people might find that these books are the opposite of de-stressing and that's okay. Nobody has to fit into a certain type of mold or trend. We are who we are, and we like what we like, and we know how we feel. So for the adult book coloring book lover in you, if you're watching this video, please continue watching and enjoy. So the first one is not so much an adult coloring book, a book as much as it is a doodling series where they give you the idea and then you can continue learning how to do it on your own. I thought this one was really cute. The first few here are by Paragon Books. Excuse me, I don't know what happened to my voice there. But the first few books here are by B Paragon Books Limited. So this one has got a lot of pages in it. Then we have the doodle writing, which teaches you different kinds of lettering. That's really cute. Bubble lettering, leaves, uh, swirlies. Um, I don't know what that looks like. Halloween type. Rope. Scribble. Monster. Fire. Spooky. You get the idea. So I think it's a good investment. I wanted to learn how to do different types of lettering so I can create some really neat bullet journals. I did find all the Moodles. I'm excited about that. You want to Moodle your way, excuse me, move, Moodle your stress away. And that's true for the Grumpy book as well. But you don't want to Moodle your happy away. You want to express your happiness and your joy. I don't think happiness and joy are the same thing. Just like bliss is not the same thing. They're textured here. It's raised, kind of embossed. It's really neat. I like how they look and how they feel. And here you would want to moodle your grumpy away. Or if you just want to wallow in your grumpy for a while. So hopefully you've seen these at your Dollar Tree. Cheer Mr. Grumpy Gills. Give him some friends. That's the kind of stuff you'll find in these books. I think they're super cute. Then, I hadn't seen anyone else haul this, but I haven't obviously watched everyone's haul here on YouTube. I think the quality of this book is really great. It's cardstock type. Mm. Come on, little book. Get back and focus. There we go. You never choose a cat. He chooses you. So you've got your quote. And then you have your scored line here for easy folding. And it's just really nice art. A cat is not bound to live by the laws of a lion. What greater gift than the love of a cat? A cat pours his body on the floor like water. I love cats because I enjoy my home, and little by little, they come its they become its visible soul. I think that's a good find. Please excuse the nails. I've been doing a lot of laundry and dishes and haven't been able to redo my nails yet, but I did want to, like I said, put these away. Maybe I didn't say that. Maybe I was just thinking it. I hear someone messing with the microwave downstairs. So the next few are coloring from mindfulness. My only, uh, I guess you could say negative review about this is that the pages, I think the pages are too thin to be double sided. I do like to use gel pens and markers in my doodling and adult coloring books. And I don't care to use colored pencils that much. I feel like I have to push too hard to get the color I really want. So if they're going to do a double-sided 
pages. I think they should use thicker ones like these. These are really nice and thick. Okay, the next are all by Paragon Books. These are really beautiful. I think the drawings here are very, very nice. So you get the idea of that one. We've got our Bollywood. There are 70 designs in each of these. These are really nice. Got some animals, some elephants. Some things that you might see if your friend tried to, not tried to, if your friend did some henna. I've seen beautiful henna artwork on brides um, in videos. I've never gotten to see it in person. Japanese. Nice detail here. The Amazon. <laughs> Sometimes I think of what's her name? Darla? A little girl with the headgear on Finding Nemo. She says, I'm a piranha. I live in the Amazon. And other times I think of Amazon.com. But I'd love to just think of this Amazon when I see this. The life and the tropical plants and animals in the Amazon. This I got from Sam's Club. It has parts of scriptures with the references. Really nice artwork. Some of it I think is frameable. I think it's a nice book to have. I believe I paid about six dollars for this. I may not have gotten this from the uh, Sam's Club, however, um, one of these two, I not, one of these I did. So it's either this Joyous Blooms or this one. I may have gotten this at Smith's Marketplace, which is a Kroger brand type store. I love it anyway. It's beautiful. The Magic Garden. This is from Bar Barons. 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 And there are quite a few of these, but I only found these two. The art's a little dark here. The ink is a little darker, but I still think it's really pretty. And this one, the Blossom Magic, has more darker uh, background pages to it. And a lot of, I like that. That's a nice touch. You see the darker ones there. This one is really nice. I think this is one of two that I've actually colored in so far. But I do love this book. It's really cute. It has wishing wells, wheelbarrows, owls, lanterns, bikes, fountains, gardens. There's one of the pictures I colored. I believe I have another one around here somewhere. Little cute bridges, bird cages, bikes, yes. There's a fountain I colored. There's a tree I colored. Nice thing about these books is you don't have to finish a page before you move on to another one. You can come and go as you please. I love glitter gel pens. I do love those very much. Look at this. This is mostly done with glitter gel pens. And some metallics. Like this rose here that's done with metallic. And those roses are metallic. These are glitter. There is some transfer. I won't complain too much about that because I think the effect is worth it. Looks really neat. And as you can see, I didn't finish that, but I can come back to it anytime I want. So I think that's a really nice book. Hopefully, if you love that, you can find it somewhere. I think that was the Sam's Club one. Dollar Tree. This one has splashes of gold on every page. I think it's a really nice book. Dollar Tree again, just for old times sake. Lisa Frank, you can't go wrong there. Life was good when Lisa Frank was very popular and I just wanted it for that reason because it brings back memories. Trapper keepers, binders. This is really pretty. 
44 mandalas. So in here, the unique thing is it has a list of all the animals you will find hidden, not really hidden, but featured in the mandalas. I hope I'm saying that right. So this one has shells and crabs, armadillo, a mouse with glasses, hmm. blind mice, some kind of lizard, fish, owls, squirrels. I think it's really a cute and nice, nicely done book. This one here, proceeds have gone to this organization. What I like about this is you'll see the picture and then you turn it over and it talks about that animal on the other side. So it's educational as well. That's an anteater. Endangered species. It's sad. It's, it's sad that these species are endangered. But I'm very happy with this book. I like it a lot. Then we have a Daria songbook. Um, it is a time garden and it is about a little fairy who lives in the clock inside the cuckoo clock. And one night she waits till a little girl goes to sleep and then she sneaks into the girl's room and investigates everything and has adventures while the girl is asleep. So there's all kinds of books and winding. Like she explores a dollhouse. That's one of the only ones I colored in here. And again, I love my glitter pens. So I did use those. Then I ordered a brand new Johanna or Joanna Bassford Magical Jungle. This one I got on Amazon. And thankfully, fortunately, whatever you want to call it, uh, this retails for around $16, but I use the Honey app. And so I got an email which said, if you order the Magical Jungle, you will only be paying $2.49, or it was $3.49, something like that. I paid less than $7 for this beautiful book. So it's got really nice inky drawings and... She's got a certain style, and in the back, she's kind of known for putting hidden key, like, uh, you have to find certain things in the, in the scenes. And she does that in The Secret Garden, which was her first publication. She does that in the back of this one as well. This one is really beautiful because... It has, if I can find some of my favorites, like cute pots and birdhouses and um, it has watering cans. There's a tree house there. No, that's just a house along a path. Sorry, I don't know why I called it a tree house. Um, with these, I just like to copy them so I can leave the book intact as is and color a copy rather than compromising the original integrity of my book although it can't hurt I mean it's not like I'm going to ruin it if I color right in the book right so I have a couple more from I think time life but that is it for my collection it's quite a collection <laughs> and I'm happy that I have it and I enjoy it very much just wanted to show it to you and hopefully um, if you have a similar video I'd love to check it out so let me know give me a nudge and until next time take care happy de-stressing happy coloring <laughs>